Next, we'll watch a short interview of Grade 11 St. Anthony. So we're here doing an interview with the Grade 11s, who are doing a sequel to what they did in Grade 10. So, as the script writers, why do you guys think that, why do you guys continue the story? Because we don't have any ideas. No, <laughs> well, yeah, we thought it's a very revolutionary idea since Yes, yes, we ran out of ideas, and yes. nobody ever done yes. this before. Yes. We thought this would be exactly. quite an interesting topic, and also it creates this nostalgic of what happens two years ago. Not really, but yeah, because we're in different classes. So, so you guys are not from the same class, but you guys try to continue. From the same class, actually. We have people we from different classes, and we yeah. mixed in, and yeah. we have some people playing major actor that also mm -hmm. played major actor from before. <laughs> so. So we're able to see some characters that came from... Well, no, not really. It's not mentioned, but th this will be an entire new story, but somehow connected in the same, around the same timeline. So a prequel or... It's a sequel. It's a sequel. Yeah. Okay, great. After the, uh, the, the event. So how long did you guys spend to put this all together? Uh, probably a month, I probably guess. A month, okay. No, two um, months. I'm saying two months. Two months. I mean, but for, for the first month, we were actually just fooling around, and then the, it was only uh, it took us like three days to actually finalize the script. Yeah, because we were very serious during <laughs> <laughs> three days, and then the rest of the day we were just fooling around, you know. So there's not really much progress uh -huh. being made. Yeah. All right. Well, then I cannot wait to see what they have to offer next. Before we watch the Great Eleven St. Anthony's performance, let's watch a short synopsis of their play. Let's welcome Gate 11 St. Anthony, The Virus Part 2. Coming live from Monthly City, massive riots are happening as a result of ex-President Adeso's arrest under the charges of corruption and conspiracy. Protests is evolved into wide-scale rampage and citizens are advised to stay indoors at all times. Things are starting to get out of... The award to the society! Democracy is corrupted! All echo! Fire your tear gas! People of the Brazilian Republic? Yes! We have been blinded by the vices of democracy, the poison of the rich, over and over. We have been thrown and sold into the capitalist programs for far too long. We, as the people of this great nation, must rebel against these false politics. Do you not desire a place where everyone is equal? Is it fair that the corrupted politicians and gangsters plan their filthy schemes while we suffer from poverty? No. no. Is it fair that our hard-earned contributions to the community does not even give us a proper meal? No. no. As a proud member of the Brazilian Republic, we must never stand such abomination that is out of the past effort of our ancestors. Today, I stand here on the behalf of the Atlantic Union to make you new and free, to unchain us from the oppression, and to bring the capitals to their knees. Yes! Amen. Oh, honey, what do you think about this new party? It sounds like a great plan, isn't it? Whatever makes you happy, I'll support it. Aw, oh, you're such a darling. What about you? What do you think, Mrs. Williams? Well, I can not disagree more about what the union told us. Yeah, by far, I think this new party will be our best hope for a brighter future. With all the past troubles caused by the previous president, it has been far too long since our country has prospered. What do you think, Liam? This Sebastian guy sounds pretty trustworthy, right? I don't know, Mort. I'm quite skeptical about the new policy. Talking our country will be good again? It's just too good to be true. Oh, come on, Liam. There's nothing skeptical about a guy that's just trying to make a change. Plus, look at everyone else's faces. Look at our parents' faces. They look so happy. 
Yeah, Mar, you got a point. The chance of this guy winning the vote seems to be very likely. But at the end of the day, it's still up to our parents to decide. Yeah, whatever. Come on. Good morning, morning citizens, citizens of the Pasilio Republic. Republic. It is another beautiful day towards a greater future. All work units, please report to your station before 7 a.m. Atlantic alcohol beverages, workers, please report to Zone 4. Atlantic food, report to Zone 7. Atlantic paper manufacturer, report to... Hi, honey. I'm going to work. Okay, I'll be back at midnight. All right, Michael. Don't push yourself too hard. Be back safe, okay? I will. Isn't there any way to turn down the volume of this? Morning, Mom. Oh, morning, sweetie. Dad went out of work. Atlanta Medicine, Zone 32. Zone 32. And lastly, Atlanta, Atlanta Path Plastic, plastic zone, zone 69. And that, that is, is all for the work zones. zones. All morning shift workers must be in their position before 7. Continue the hard work, everyone. This is the best way to a bright future. 7? Did the working hours get even earlier? It was 7.30 to 9.30 last month, and it's 7 to 10 now? This is absurd! Look, son, it's all for a good cause, right? Well, I think this government didn't tell us the whole truth. Anyways. I'm going to Mort's place. Son, just watch out with what you say. People might be hearing your words somewhere. Just be careful, okay? Okay. Bye, Mom. Bye, sweetie. I want to invite some funds into my summer home in Spain. Or maybe into the weapons manufacturer. How are the production lines going? Sir, according to the latest financial report, our output from last month has increased by 10%. Fabulous! Looks like my plan of extending working hours in the factories is working well! Then let us proceed the project on my summer home! Contact the architect immediately! I want the plan out by next month! More good news, sir! The number of our opposer has decreased significantly this month! As long as we continue to take out our plan and wiping out the opposers, we can keep our position steady! This is going way better than I expected! Having the people uniformed in each doing the task! I mean, this is how humans are supposed to be treated, right? And this is the only way to prevent disorder in the society. If we continue to take out our plan and wipe out the opposers, as we can take down Europe and Asia, and at last, the American continent. What do you think, General? This will be a wonderful plan, sir. Very well. Keep up the good work, and eventually, you will all get rewarded. Oh, hey. Hey, Mrs. Williams. Hey, Liam, you're here. Oh, Mr. Williams, hi. Hey. Dad. Oh, darling, you must be exhausted. Let me carry you to bed. Excuse us, kids, I'm going to take care of Mr. Williams. That'll be fine, Mrs. Williams. Hey, Mort. Yeah? Don't you think this union is a scam? All the promised benefits that mentioned before the election, right now, it's all gone. All I see are poor and overworked people, and they didn't even notice it. But I saw their project- Whatever, Liam. There's no way to change it anyways. Plus, sometimes things are just meant to be changed. Can't you see that? More. we must do something. It's time that I show you this. Let's go. Fellow citizens, please gather. I think we all know why we are set to be here. We are all oppressed under the tyranny of this union. The utopia dimension does not exist. They've been spreading false information since the beginning, luring us into a cage that we continuously work, believing we will have a better future by paying off our hard work. And this must stop. Yes. We must take actions against these tyrants. By the end of tomorrow, our suffering will be no more. Because of your strong support, we have finally gained enough resources to fight back these tyrants. And lastly, we will put Sebastian off his seat. Yes. Yes.
Um, hey Liam, how should I say this? You really did it this time, man. I'm proud of you. Gathering force without being noticed by the government is extremely smart. Well, you just have to find the right place and right people. Poorest area in the city is the best place for gathering. Anyways, go get some rest. We have work to do tomorrow. All right, I'll go check out the front gates first, all right? All right, bye-bye. Check the door shed in the west. There might be some more riders hiding there. Unit 501, report to the Opus storage to search for riders. Search carefully. Sir, we will have this session secure and cleared. Very well. If that is so, then it is about time to return. As for them, they all know the consequences for standing out. Good morning, citizens of the Pacillian Republic. It is another beautiful day towards a greater future. All work units, please report to your spot before 6. Atlantic alcohol beverage workers, please report to Zone 4. Atlantic food, report to Zone 7. Atlantic paper manufacturer, report to... Honey, your breakfast is ready. All right, coming. Open up! We are Grade 11 St. Anthony. Thank you for watching our play!